If you're using the Microsoft Office suite on the onboard computer of your New Line display, you actually have built-in draw tools that you can leverage. I'm gonna show two examples, one in PowerPoint and one in Microsoft Word. So on my PowerPoint, I'm gonna go ahead and hit the slideshow button to put this into full screen. Object recognition is also working on PowerPoint, Word, Excel, and OneNote, which allows me to use differences in thickness to do different gestures. If I take my hand, my finger, and I swipe from right to left, it will advance my slides. If I go the opposite direction from left to right, it will go backwards. If I pick up a stylus, which has the fine point on it, PowerPoint will immediately recognize it as a writing utensil, and it will allow me to annotate on the screen. If I use the back of my hand, it will erase. The wonderful thing about this is it's all built into PowerPoint directly. If I tap the bottom left quadrant, I'll see my menu pop up here on the left, and I have my exit button at the bottom. PowerPoint immediately asks if I want to save and keep my ink annotations, which now become Microsoft objects directly on top of my document, just like a text box or an image. If I wanna save this, I can go ahead and hit file and save, save over top of it, and make edits to it later on. The next example is in Microsoft Word, which actually shows how this works. On the top here, you will see a draw tab. This draw tab is what we're using to annotate. But again, object recognition is still working. So if I grab my pen, I can immediately start writing, highlight my words that rhyme here. If I use my finger, I can scroll up and down or I can zoom. And if I use the back of my hand again, it will erase. So we are leveraging the draw tools at the top here. Again, these are Microsoft objects, so they can be edited after the fact, even if I save this document now and reopen it tomorrow.